It is Manchester City 3, Manchester United 1, Manchester United dropping 3 points after going a go ahead against Man City very early. Manchester United just letting us down playing shit football as expected. Manchester United getting up, getting the R word, getting it up the mm mm mm. You know what I mean? Bent over. Get the lube. Spit on our hands. You get me? Get the condoms on so we can be safe, you know. Protection is what we needed as well. Whatever it was, oil us up. That's what we got today, you know. Because all the time, we just never touched the ball. We never did anything. We didn't even... All we did was a counter-attack, a little jab. It's like we punched our guy. We said, ha ha, I got you. And then the guy said, you know what? I'm going to show you what. We got P. Diddy. We got Diddy. We got Brother Loved out there. 11 Diddy's playing, uh, playing against us like we was Usher. All of our uh, batty hole and batty crease. We got... I know that we lost. We lost. We lost the game that we could have ended up doing something special, but we lost it. But you know what? 3 1 isn't that bad, you know, as I thought we could have been six. I started the day thinking that we we're going to get pumped, pumped, you know, it, sex up well, differently, legs in the air, different positions. But you know what? Respectfully, we lost respectfully. 3-1 is something that we can just hold our head up high and say, you know what, it's okay. We got what, what happened. But Manchester United, oh, defensive football, counter-attacking football. Is this what we are? You know what? I'm tired. You know what? Bruno Fernandes as well and Marcus Rashford, even though Marcus Rashford, you got that goal. You still play shit throughout the whole entire game. Bruno Fernandes, as instrumental and key, was in certain aspect of our counter-attack. You still made the wrong decision. You hold the ball up when you're not supposed to. Rashford as well, having opportunities. But guys, <sighs> disappointment today for those who watch. Smash that like button, guys, and share across all social media platforms. Hey, let's talk about in that first 45 minutes because United defending so well, getting the first goal. And you look at that first goal, Marcus Rashford. Andre Onana with a lovely ball over the top to find Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes turning around saying, here's my man Rashford running onto it. He passes the ball back to Rashford and Rashford to rifle it in, in the back of the net to make it 1-0 to Manchester United. And we was in heaven at that moment. It was sensational magic shit. We was like, oh my God. Rashford told us that if we don't back him, if you back him good, if you don't, he'll show us it's even better. You know what I mean? And he showed us for that small moment, but then he brought us back into reality because there was opportunities for him. But he makes mistakes. Him and Gennaro, they don't, they don't like each other. They don't want to feed the ball to each other. They don't even know each other. Again, Manchester United, an opportunity that landed to them and they're making mistakes and we are lucky that man city didn't even equalize quickly because harlan missing a sitter a, a sitter of the century just right in front of him the ball going over the top and man city was just all over us pressing us hard pressing us on the ball without even saying that man pressed us good without even the pause they pressed the hell out of us bruv you get me Half time 1 0 to Manchester United. We're thinking, you know what? Give us something in the second half. Don't fold, you know. Don't fold, especially. Don't fold to Foden. Do you know what Manchester United? They folded to Foden as soon as that second half started. Phil Foden equalized from outside the box, making Andre Onana again look useless in goal. But Onana had a good game. I'll be honest with you, no disrespect to Andre Onana, but equalizing from Foden. I was super pissed off, guys, because we was just put in our box. Throughout the whole entire game, I was doing any, unable to do anything against Manchester City. Oh, we was boxed up in a cage like we was an animal, you know, being poked at, you know. We're doing this, yeah, 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 leave us alone. And the kids are just laughing at us, poking us with a stick. That's what Man City was doing against us. The second goal, forward and wrapping us over as over another goal. Well talking as well. Opening up on the on the left hand on the right hand side of Manchester United where Cambawala was, Foden to finish it off, ball going past Onana like it was nothing, and then Haaland, Amrabat who came on to do fuckeries to do shitness Am Amrabat, what a joke man, you bald headed prick, losing the ball, and of course Man City capitalising the situation, giving the ball straight to Haaland for Haaland to finish it off to make it three one Haaland. Finished us off. You know, we got Diddy today. We got it. We got it. We couldn't come out of the box, bro. It was cat in the hat. 
for us, we were stuck in that hat for the whole entire time. We never made it out. Manchester United losing. What I've got to say is that at least we didn't lose that badly, you know. Hats up to us to not get him pummeled, pumped, annihilated, even though it was 3-1. We still got better though, it's to me. Because the possessions and the, and the statics just show that Manchester United were not good enough. It was all Manchester City all over, all day for 19 minutes, man. We got it. There is no man in the match today. There's plenty of donkey of the matches. You guys let me know in the comments as well. Players today, I just thought that Rashford, you know, even after the goal, did nothing afterwards. But he, he had a poor game, in my opinion. Same as Bruno. After the assist, that's what they do. They do their thing, they show for a hot second, they never show for the rest of the game. Garbage. Johnny Evans was excellent, and Varane as well was excellent in defence. Andre Nano was good. Kobe Mino did his part in the first half. Faded away. Ganacho was garbage. Garbage throughout the whole game. Anyway, guys, this has been your match reaction from your boy, Avorin Spice. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comments. Who was your man in the match? Your donkey of the match as well. Um, did Manchester United deserve to lose 3 1? Or they could have lost even worse, even more than that. You know, what's your thoughts? Remember, guys, to join tomorrow, 8 p.m. UK time for the catch up for the full reaction with Amanda. Till next time, guys, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it ready united because your boy is out. I was so shit. <laughs> Peace.